Hello everyone, now let us discuss about CPT coding guidelines for radiology part 9a. In part 9, we will be discussing about nuclear medicine and we are making two parts of it. Now coming to the definition of nuclear medicine. Nuclear medicine is a specialized area of radiology that use very small amounts of radioactive materials or radiopharmaceuticals to examine organ function and its structure. Now coming to types of nuclear medicine. Nuclear medicine is broadly categorized into two types. First purpose is diagnostic purpose and second is therapeutic purpose. Now coming to the various systems that come under diagnostic nuclear medicine are endocrine, hemopoietic reticulo endothelial and lymphatic system, gastrointestinal system, musculoskeletal system, cardiovascular system, respiratory system, nervous system and gential urinary system. The CPTs are categorized by system wise. So in the current session we will be focusing on endocrine system, blood and lymphatic system, gastrointestinal system, musculoskeletal system. Now coming to the CPT codes of Diagnostic Nuclear Medicine Endocrine System. The first code is 78012. The description is thyroid uptake, single or multiple quantitative measurements including stimulation, suppression or discharge when performed. The next code is 78013. The description is thyroid imaging including vascular flow when performed. The next code is 78014. Here the code is starting with small letter. So this comes under thyroid imaging with single or multiple uptakes quantitative measurements including stimulation, suppression and discharge when performed. Some more codes that come under endocrine system are 78015. It deals with thyroid carcinoma metastasis imaging limited area for example neck and chest only whereas the code 78016 it deals with here the code is starting with small letter so the complete description is thyroid carcinoma metastasis imaging with additional studies for example urinary recovery and the next code is 78018 this comes under thyroid carcinoma metastasis imaging whole body. The next code is an add-on code plus 78020. It deals with thyroid carcinoma metastasis uptake. List separately in addition to code for primary procedure. Use plus 78020 in conjunction with 78018 thyroid carcinoma metastasis imaging whole body. So in addition to this code, you need to add this add-on code. In addition to 78018, you need to add plus 78020. The next code is 78070. Parathyroid planar imaging including subtraction when performed. The next is 78071. This is parathyroid planar imaging with tomographic study. That is nothing but SPECT. The next code is 78072. This is also starting with small letter. So the complete description is parathyroid planar imaging with tomographic and concurrently acquired computer, computed tomography for anatomical localization. So this is the complete description for 78072. The next code is 78075. It deals with adrenal imaging, cortex and or, or medulla. And finally 78099. This is an unlisted endocrine procedure diagnostic nuclear medicine. By this we complete the diagnostic nuclear medicine codes for endocrine system. Let us discuss an example. A one year post thyroidectomy patient who had thyroid cancer is coming in for area imaging of the neck and chest to evaluate for metastasis. 
patient had thyroid cancer and thyroidectomy he is coming for the evaluation of metastasis areas are neck and chest only so what cpt code is to be reported for nuclear medicine exam the answer is 78015 because he is coming for thyroid carcinoma metastasis imaging and the area is limited that is only neck and chest so this is the appropriate code 78015 now coming to the nuclear medicine codes diagnostic for blood and lymphatic system hemopoietic reticular endothelial and lymphatic system the first code is 78102 the description is bone marrow imaging limited area the next code is 78103 here the bone marrow imaging multiple areas and finally 78104 it deals with bone marrow imaging whole body the next code is 78110 it deals with plasma volume radio pharmaceutical volume dilution technique separate procedure single sampling the next code is 78111 it deals with plasma volume radio pharmaceutical volume dilution technique multiple samplings the next is 78120 it deals with red cell volume determination a separate procedure single sampling red cell volume determination 78120 whenever it is done as a separate procedure and single sampling is done you need to provide 78120 The next code is seven eight one two one. It deals with red cell volume determination, multiple samplings. The next is seven eight one two two. It deals with whole body volume determination, including separate measurement of plasma volume and red cell volume, radio pharmaceutical volume dilation technique. And next code is seven eight one three zero. It deals with red cell survival study. and the code that has been de deleted from this session is 78135 now coming to next code that is 78140 it deals with labeled red cell sequestration differential organ or tissue for example splenic or hepatic and or or hepatic the next code is 78185 it deals with spleen imaging only with or without vascular flow The next code is seven eight one nine one. It deals with platelet survival study. Now coming to next code that is seven eight one nine five. It deals with lymphatics and lymph node imaging. And finally seven eight one nine nine. It is nothing but unlisted hemopoietic reticular endothelial and lymphatic procedure, diagnostic nuclear medicine. Now coming to the next system, the gastrointestinal system. The first code is seven eight two zero one. It deals with liver imaging static only. And the next code is seven eight two zero two. It deals with liver imaging with vascular flow. And for spleen imaging only, you need to report seven eight one eight five. And one more important point here is codes seven eight two zero five and seven eight two zero six are deleted. For that purpose, we need to report seven eight eight zero three. For tomographic single area example, head, neck, chest, pelvis, single day imaging, and the next code is seven eight two one five. It deals with liver and spleen imaging static only. Now coming to seven eight two one six, it deals with liver and spleen imaging with vascular flow. And the next code is seven eight two two six. It deals with hepatobiliary system imaging, including gallbladder when present. And the next code is seven eight two two seven. It deals with hepatobiliary system imaging, including gallbladder when present, with pharmacologic intervention, including quantitative. measurements when performed the next code is 78230 it deals with salivary gland imaging 
the next is 7.8.2.3.1. It deals with salivary gland imaging with serial images. The next is 7.8.2.3.2. It deals with salivary gland functional study. Now coming to next code 7.8.2.5.8. It deals with esophageal motility study. The next is 7.8.2.6.1. It deals with gastromucosa Im imaging. The next is 7.8.2.6.2. It deals with gastroesophageal reflex study. The next is 7.8.2.6.4. It deals with gastric emptying imaging study. Example solid liquid or both. 7.8.2.6.4. It deals with gastric emptying imaging study. The next is 7.8.2.6.5. It deals with small bowel transit gastric imaging study with small bowel transit the next is 78262 it deals with gastric emptying imaging study with small bowel and colon transit multiple days the next code is 78267 it deals with urea breath test C14 isotopic acquisition for analysis. Here the sample is taken for analysis. The next code is 78268. It involves urea breath test. Analysis is included in the CPT 78268. Whereas in 78267 the sample is taken for analysis. And for breath hydrogen or methane testing and analysis use 91065. The next code is 78278. It deals with acute gastrointestinal blood loss image. 78278. It deals with acute gastrointestinal blood loss imaging. Now coming to next code that is 78282. It deals with gastrointestinal protein loss. The next is 78290. It deals with intestine imaging. Example ectopic gastric mucosa. Meckel's localization and volvulus. The next code is 78291. It deals with peritoneal venous shunt patency test. For example, Levine or Denver shunt. Now coming to the final CPT 78299, which is nothing but unlisted gastrointestinal procedure, diagnostic nuclear medicine. Let us discuss an example. A 50-year-old male patient presents with nausea and vomiting. And gastric emptying scan was performed. What is the appropriate CPT? The appropriate CPT is 78264, which is nothing but gastric emptying imaging study, example solid liquid or both. In this procedure, radio pharmaceutical agent has been administered. For that purpose, a HCPCS code should be added in addition A9541. A9541 which is nothing but TC99M sulfur chloride diagnostic per steady dose up to 20 millicuries. Now coming to the nuclear medicine codes for musculoskeletal system. The first CPT is 78300. It deals with bone and or joint imaging limited area. The next code is 78305. It deals with bone and joint imaging multiple areas. The next is 78306. It deals with bone and or joint imaging whole body. Limited area for bone and joint imaging you need to code 78300. And for multiple areas of bone and joint imaging you need to code 78305. And for whole body for bone and joint imaging, you need to code 78306. The next code is 78315. This deals with bone and joint imaging study, three-phase study. One more important point is code 78320 has been deleted. And in order to report this, you need to code 78803. For tomographic, single area, head, neck, chest, pelvis, single day image. The next code is 78350. It deals with bone density study, which is nothing but bone mineral content, one or more sites, single photon absorptometry. Whereas code 
78351 it deals with dual photon absorptimetry one or more sites the final code is 78399 which is nothing but unlisted musculoskeletal procedure diagnostic nuclear medicine by this we complete the nuclear medicine codes for musculoskeletal system let us discuss an example a 45 year old female patient presents with knee pain and the patient has a history of knee, knee arthroplasty a three phase bone steady scan a three phase bone scan was performed of the bilateral knees and 20 mci of tc mdp which is nothing but a radio pharmaceutical agent was injected intravenously what is the appropriate cpt the appropriate cpt is 78315 which is nothing but bone and or joint imaging three phase study and additionally hcpcs code a9503 should be included in order to indicate the radio pharmaceutical agent that has been administered thank you for watching please subscribe for further videos on medical coding and cpc training